What are you up to? Oh! oh! What? It's inside of you. He's gonna make it expand inside of him. Oh! <laughs> Shit, you're right! Oh! Wait, Ice is really dead? Yo, Yo really that killed was Isaac. fire! Oh no, it ain't over. Ah oh, shit. Ah oh, shit, this nigga's dead, bro. Stop it! Stop oh, it, five! Stop yeah, it, five! Yeah. Stop it, five! You just be talking too much, Eisen! Fuck this nigga up! What's good, yo? We back, RTT. Gang, gang, gang. Wow. gang. And if it's your first time here, it definitely won't be your last. Make sure you kill, murder, and smash that subscribe button. Whoop, dude. Check out that Patreon. We got early and full reactions of Bleach, One Piece, Boruto, and a lot of on animes that you guys rock with and movies you guys rock with, too. You got Black Widow. Man, we got the new uh, Space Jam movie. We got a lot of movies Spice on there. Jam. Spice Jam. Spice Jam. I got two movies at the same time. Well, I'll show you. That. I don't know if it was a movie, but... <laughs> Wow, yeah. I was to the Spice Jam. Yeah, that got me through some days. Yo, 30 seconds was it free? Oh, no, my mom had the black box. Yeah, the box. black box. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Play, play, play. <laughs> Robbie said 30 seconds was it free? <laughs> I'm not even gonna ask. I'm not even gonna ask. I gotta get this off in 30 <laughs> seconds, my <laughs> G. Nah, yo, yo this gonna be the list. 30 <laughs> seconds. Nah, Joel, I was a, yes. I, 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 I was a late bloomer, bro. Nah, he was. Nah, he was. He did tell me I that. Did, I didn't join that, uh, the, the wave to, to, like, Oh. Like, high school? Poopity. Like. Wow, I didn't know that. Yeah, high school. Yeah. Learn new things every day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's not, I mean, you don't want to, like, to talk about that. Yeah, I know. Poopity scoop. And make sure you give this video a like and have that notification bell ringing for that Bleach playlist. And make sure you follow us on our second YouTube channel, RTTV Vlogs, where we're going to have a bunch of original content for you, such as public challenges, podcasts, gaming, and much, much more. So make sure you follow and subscribe. RTTV Vlogs, thank you for getting us to 10K. We on the road to 20K. Then we on the road to 30K and beyond. And we're back with another episode of Bleach and Ichigo. Bleach. It looks like he might have mastered both his hollow and... And his Zombok toe. Barely. So hopefully yeah. we have enough strength now to defeat Aizen. Aizen is also facing off with one of his best friends, Tatsuki. Oh, yeah. And Rangiku came and showed up, but again, had a lot to say about that. She ended up on the floor. I don't know if she's dead or not, but Aizen is going to be scolding Gin. You think so? Yes. Mm. He, saw, he said he got it, Pat. He did say he got it. I handled it, and Gin decided to handle it himself. He did. He did handle it. The countdown she, continues to the he, you shitting me moment of Bleach. He, mm. he, he did handle it, and he What's just that? left her in shock. Feel me? Kisuke coming That's back. Why he an attacker. He... He... Not he does that a lot. Like, yeah. when editing reactions, Jerry yeah. be like, nah, but then she... So, oh, my God, he... Yeah, and I'd be like, bro, fit, what the, where are you going with yeah, that? I was like, yo, that's not funny, yo, because I know I, I, I think I he'd be sleep talking. And then he wakes up and just stops talking. <laughs> hey. No, you don't realize that it's like the myth will stop talking, and then the other, <laughs> you know, the maniac will take control right after. He's like, what the hell is the myth talking about? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yo. Man, that was hilarious. Yeah, yo, Pat, one for Pat. <laughs> <laughs> right, Yo, episode man. 307 fully, and fully, 308 Fully one for, one for Pat Captain Isaac, what is this? <laughs> He's torturing those poor kids by letting them think they'll get away That's so grimy Yeah, bro. why is he pulling a Jason Voorhees right here? <laughs> <laughs> oh, he, so bought, he borrowed a bunch of stuff, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Boy went on a borrow spree It makes sense, it's kind of like an apocalypse Everybody's just sleeping But you want me to explain everything right now while there's a madman trying to kill us? Can't blame him for asking. Y'all should have been flexed. Thank you, Don Kanoji. You know, my ass, I would actually go to the edge of town and then go into the forest that's actually the Soul Society. Maybe they can't go out to this part of the forest. Yeah. You know how if he put the sh he put the shield up to pre protect himself? I wonder if that really hit him, if it would really hurt him. I feel you. I doubt it. 
Yo, dick. I respect that dude. He's actually trying. Like, <laughs> like, all right, let me throw a smoke grenade. Let me dip. Oh, he's actually trying to incinerate him. Wow, I really respect yeah, that kid. Yeah, be out. Be out. After that, if I know that he's not human, I'm going to continue running. He's mad cool. Look at him. Got a yeah. straight face on him. <laughs> like, he lives for this. Eisen's really a bully, man. Yeah, like. Come on, Ichigo. Or somebody. Sweating. <laughs> it's like that. I ain't want to come back, bro. <laughs> Your dumb ass made me. The fool? Oh, the dude with the afro. I got you out here and him and not running, bro. <laughs> like watching him yeah, like, like break out of shit. Uh, oh, okay. no, no, <laughs> black man, yeah, black man, no. the <laughs> But like, why are you guys waiting? As soon as he said run, you guys are still in shock. Like, as soon as he did that attack, I would have been out. But the fact that Eisen's even entertaining this is like so weird to me. Oh, not well. He's trying to awaken Ichigo's power. He thinks by killing them, it'll bring out more power within just Ichigo. Kill him. Yeah, that's yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's like child's play right now. Killed her. See how he's a liar. Eyes. You're a liar. She's alive. I slither, looking for prey with the tip of my tongue. I don't believe that, man. Yeah, I don't. I swallow everything whole. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, <laughs> that's what you do, yo. Yeah? <laughs> Not me. Don't look at me. After you kill them, I'll hang their corpses on the outskirts of town. Wow. Damn. I would love it if that was actually the case. What are you up to? Oh! oh! What? We knew that was coming. I knew he was going to turn on his what ass. What did I tell you? What did I say? I said he was going to turn on his ass. Why? I want him to be so loyal, man. God damn it, again. Nah, nah, he got his own vibes, bro. Man, I just want him to be loyal. It's more interesting that he's not loyal. Yeah. It's funny how he said gain. It's like he's seen it coming. Nah, like, he's, like, he's a snake. He already just told him that. Yeah, he's like, I have no heart, my guy. Wanting to complete hypnosis. It took me decades of gaining your trust just to get that single fact. Wow. wow. Decades? Watching them made me very nervous. <laughs> Yo, let's <laughs> go, dude. Wow. That's actually kind of crazy. What's his plan, though? There's a tiny piece missing. It's inside of you. He's gonna make it expand inside of him. Oh, shit, you're right. Inside you, Captain. Oh, wow. What? Scatter. Kill him. Kamishi Ninoyari. Oh, wow. He has a dope call for, to his sword. Kill him. Nah, he's shaking. He's the greatest character ever, bro. Isn't that what you wanted? But the question, oh, oh my gosh. The greatest character of all time, bro. So what's going to happen now? Like, why? Like, Gain is a true villain. That's what I was trying to wonder. I'm like, why did Gain kill him or wanted to kill him? Well, maybe it's his promise to Izuru that they were talking about. Him and uh, Rangiku. Imagine like, Aizen killed his brother or something. Or the person who lo he loved the most. This is a dope betrayal, wow. though. Wow. Yo, he really blew his chest open, bro. Like, the only way he can survive is that Hogaku manifests his eyes and survive this. He has to grab the Hogaku. Yes, grab that shit. Oh. So you gotta be effed up. Oh, he, oh, he got grabbed it. it. He got it. Let go! Oh. Wait, Eyes is really dead? Yo, he Yo really that killed was Aizen. fire. Did not see that coming. Yo, Gene, you are, you are officially part of Dark Willpower alum. That wow. was fucking that fire. That was nutty, bro. But what was that flashback that he watched? It was like he poured, like, what? Oh. oh. He got hurt he in the process. He nearly took his whole arm off. Was that last move that he did? Yeah. It's over now. Are you talking to Rengengu? Oh, no. It ain't over. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, shit. This nigga's dead, bro. Wait, there's no way. That power of Hogaku. Maybe it has manifested inside of him. Oh shit. Hey, if Ichigo could come back to life, I'm not surprised that Isaac could yeah, come back to life. Yeah, that's a fact. It's like, yo. Damn, that betrayal was fire though, bro. My thing is, I just want to learn why 
like more about it. getting. Yeah, right? I want yeah. more, no, more, more about getting. I had a feeling he was gonna do it, but like, why? <sighs> Yo, butterfly eyes and <laughs> to poof. See, but that makes me think. So Kisuke might still belong to Kisuke too. Then you don't need it like in you, whatever. Like, oh like, no, he has, he has oh just, no. The difference oh, is no. he actually subjugated that shit into him, though. Yeah. Oh, Gin is that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah he might Gin's be dead 100% right dead, bro. Like, what is that right there? Who is that? Well, no, what is that? I feel like next episode we're gonna get a whole Gin flashback. We need to, cause I don't know what the hell's well, going on. This with is the game. beginning of the game flashback. I've been cool with Rengeku my whole life. So oh, look at his eyes. I'll kill you. Oh. He didn't want to be that guy. So that's that was the whole thing. <laughs> There's more to it. Dead. Ah, uh, he is fully dead. Wow. Dead. Wow. But damn, I didn't know he was cool around Gekko for that long. Like, damn. Nah, remember they showed him as kids together. It was one f a flashback a long time ago. Though. Oh, God. That's yeah. Cool. Nice didn't know he was going to try him this whole time. I just wonder why he keep him close. I'm saying, what's the point of that? Keep your friends close, keep your enemies closer. closer. So that was the biggest threat throughout his whole life. So I guess he wanted to keep it that close. So at least you don't have to worry about him from a distance. It's like he's right next to me, so I know when he makes his move, it's gonna be sooner than later. He really brought the music out for your boy. What is that? I have no idea. I have no idea. Oh jeez, Rick. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. <laughs> but I don't think Gene is gonna go out without like a like mortal, like inflicting a mortal wound. You know what I'm saying? Like that was the mortal wound. He another just one. Surviving it. <laughs> another one. Another mortal wound. Another mortal wound. <laughs> another one. That was another, another one. one. The same way I do today. Was he talking about Eisen? It seemed like that. Because the thing is, like, I plan on devouring you in terms of killing you, but then I have to put on a persona of I love you. So can I be able to do both at the same time? Mm. Like, I, I, but when I t when I try to kill you, am I still gonna be able? To exactly. Say, yeah. Nah, maybe he was really talking about Rangeku. Yeah. Because it seemed like she was kind of dreaming, and then she woke up. But he doesn't plan on devouring her though. That's the only thing. We're killing her. Yeah, but like, maybe he's not referring to him necessarily devouring or defeating Aizen. Maybe he's just refer referring to the fact that if I did you dirty, would you still love me the way that I love you? In that sense, because I'm pretty sure he doesn't love Aizen. Well, see, uh, yeah, I was just saying that in terms of fake love to Aizen, because he's like, if I say with the same lips that I plan on devouring you and say I love you. Oh, oh, damn, he ripped his arm off. It's not happening, Wells. So he had his own Hogyaku. Mm hmm Wow. It's not happening, Wells. He's done, bro. Death to Gin. But that's how they gonna kill Gin, though? That's a great death. I know, but I wanted so much more for him, like... <laughs> In terms of what, like... Just more backstory for Gin. I feel like we're gonna get that this episode. Thanks to you, I have finally evolved into a being that transcends both hollows and soul reapers. That is thanks to Gin, though, because if Gin didn't kill him in that moment, then he wouldn't have evolved so like that. So that's why he kept him close. <laughs> wow. Aizen, how, did, how are you so calculated? I don't understand. Yeah, he was so cocky that, yeah, I think Gin is actually going to kill me, but through him killing me, I'm actually going to become a bigger being. Yeah, they can't stand it. He's too strong. He's not so strong they can't at all withstand it. Damn, now my nigga Gin. This song, every time it comes out, this is one of the best scorers, yo. Yeah. I love it. This shit, hit, this shit hit home right here, every bro. Every single time. I'll fix everything so you won't be crying anymore. So that's why he said you're the, he's the boss because Isaac probably inflicted like damage upon wherever they're from. Yeah. And Rangiku knows now because he tried to save her. Mm hmm. What was taken? That red shit? Or just like Maybe peace of mind. Shit. It could have been that. Damn. Yeah, I love this. This, nah, is, a, this is a great death, death yeah, right here, bro. Go crazy. <laughs> Shout out to that voice actress. Actress. Oof. Oh, is that Ichigo? Ichi? Oh! Yeah! oh! oh! With the new 
sleeve? Yo, guess who's back? That was cool. Why do they always give him a cool ass look? God damn. He always has the best intros. So I guess we're not going to get a backstory from him right away. Oh, that's what I've been waiting for. Oh, Thanks, Dad, dad for holding it yeah. down. He looks grown or something. Oh no, explain it. Oh no, because of how long it been in there? Three months. Yeah, you're right, you yeah. see his dad got a beard and stuff. It's new form, Ichigo. You got a chain around it. Come on, man. Punk rock, Ichigo. Yeah, he look <laughs> way different, bro. Oh boy, Ichigo, yo. One in three years. I know, right? All right, my sisters are safe. Yeah. <laughs> yep. The hyperbolic time chamber, boy. Tutsuki. On another level, brought up his age and his skills. Nah, Ichigo He's look really lit grown. No, I'm Kuro Madani Zanosuke. Kuro Madani, that's me. Ooh. He actually tried to guess the name too. <laughs> He's definitely Evan. That's Evan. That's because you're not his level, yeah. baby. Yo, the chains wrapped around his arm. Yo, damn, the character designer killed it. I don't feel a thing. You have no spirit. That's energy. how strong I am, you buster. It's a pump fake, bro. I would still be able to sense it. You yeah, nope, no, you won't. Yeah, that's why Eisen's really gonna lose. To you let the final chance that I gave you slip away. He's tripping. You don't see the chains on his arm. <laughs> He sees a conviction on his face now. He's like, perfect. Compared to before, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Look at the scared little boy face right there. Look at him, he's so scared. Now you see the. You're right. The, even the way they drew his face is more, way more conviction than it was before. It's, it's like crazy. he's so sure he's about to whoop Eisen's ass, bro. Because he took. Look he beat him. on his inner demons. Yup. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> that fucking works. This is my favorite music right here. Yup. Yeah, I feel like he yeah. needed to know that, like, I helped you level up. All right, I'm good. I'm out of here. I will not destroy Katakuta Town. You will. Yeah, hey, shut up. talking too I'll much, I'll you to the destination. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. I told you. We're not sick you there. It was crazy. Dumbass. Nah, he just sunned the shit out of Aizen right, right now. Oh, my we're about, to get a, we're about to get a Dragon Ball Z style type of fight. And he's not even hot fight. That's one of the coolest. Yeah, he's really one of yeah, the coolest. The yeah, yeah, bro. I don't know anime characters really that, that's cool to that right there, protagonist wise. Well, I mean, he's the first oh, Ultra Will Power alum for a reason. <laughs> well, his seriousness, too. That's yeah. what I love. I love it, bro. Remind me of Goku when he turned like Super Saiyan 2. I already, know who, like, my, face I already know who my first round draft pick is Ichigo. <laughs> Ichigo over Luffy. Done. <laughs> <laughs> says nah, you finish, says you done. Scatter. <laughs> we gotta do all that just to go to another point. Say, boy, get out of here. Oh, that's crazy. See, that's how they had to leave Katakura Town. You see, with you here, I can test my powers that transcend those of Hollows and Soul Reapers to my heart's content. Well, your dumbass thought I couldn't handle it. That's really crazy. Every attack he negates actually transfers over and hits somewhere else. And Ichigo is just so calm, like, yo, that nigga is lit, bro. So lit. Oh. <laughs> you think? Oh, he's right. His right arm wow. is his Sanbok toe. <laughs> then do it! Yeah, then do, do it! it. He's dare not gonna do it! Stop it! Stop oh, it, five! Stop yeah. it, five! Yeah. Stop it, five! You just be talking too much, Aizen! Ichigo said talk to him nice! Nah, Ichigo, yeah, this is, this is one of the coolest moments in the show. Everything's spicy! <laughs> wow, and didn't Aizen do that to him? When he grabbed his sword, well, yeah. I think he'll, he'll lose him yeah. earlier. Yeah. This is such an anime moment. <laughs> he caught it? Is really such a mind-blowing thing to you? Yes, I did catch your sword. Does that scare you? <laughs> you comprehend happened right before your eyes. Now only oh, did he catch his... Stop it. 
Doesn't Ichigo never talks more than he needs to. What just happened was simply a moment where your physical strength temporarily exceeded. Shut up, Bison. Shut up. You're not better than me. You just had a moment where you was better than me. All right, that's all it was. I will make sure that an anomaly like that never happens again. He's in, he's in his feelings right yeah. now. Ichigo's making him doubt himself now. Yeah. Yeah. He wasn't ready to meet his match. Oh, he's doing oh, incantations now, yeah. yeah. It's gonna be funny when Ichigo just gets through this. It's like, all that was for nothing. <laughs> Yo, Ichigo's such a G, bro. I mean, get out of here. I can't bro, like, what what do you, his what hand. What do you think this was, bro? You're doing, you're doing the most, and the most isn't even working for you. Cut so, it out. At this point, Ichigo should be able to beat him, but then, like, yeah. Seconds. I'm stronger than you, bro. Erased that entire mountain. That was mine. <laughs> that was my force, Eisen. That was my sword. Yep. Now it's my turn. Eisen. Fuck this nigga up! Oh! oh. Shoulder slash! Wow. That's how they have the Damn. 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 Oh, that's that, two? That, that was, that was two, two right there. Wow, magnificent. That was two phenomenal episodes, bro. It's two one of the best Bleach episodes right there. That Gen moment and this right here. That was one of the best reintroductions of a protagonist after a level up that I've seen in quite some time, my brother. Yeah, that was equivalent to like when Naruto came in after Sakura screen. Naruto yeah. he came yeah. in, boom, Sage mode. You know what I'm saying? That right there with his new transformation, mm -hmm. bro, that was some epitome of uh, introductions yeah. right there. That boy came through and just the whole time skip of him working out I mean training and then passing time and him coming back older it really reminds me of the essence of Dragon Ball Z when Goku and Gohan went into the time by the time chamber to train for um so when they came out Gohan was older and I think Ichigo beat Gohan oh for that moment yeah. and that's saying yeah. a lot that's what, what saying, Super Saiyan 2 Gohan no, I'm saying the engines. Oh, Coming back, yeah. Okay. Like him walking off the top by the time chamber compared. Because when Gohan walked out, everybody was like, oh, yeah, he was Super sure. Saiyan, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 Remember they were able to stay Super Saiyan for a minute and they yeah. were able to stay. Mm -hmm. So but I feel like Ichigo's was more like, yo, like it's do it. Like literally when you come back, it's, you don't have time to change clothes. You have to literally get to fighting. And that's what I liked. It was in Cell Games. Yeah, Ichigo, whatever, whatever's, like, whatever's in that man don't even make no sense. Because I know Aizen's like, my G, I had to do all this Hogyoku bullshit. I had to sell, I got to get mine, get this man's, <laughs> rob him, steal from him, kill like 50 people, give their lives to the Hogyoku, do all this extra shit. And this dude just come out, you gonna grab my shit, like, with your bare hands? Yeah. Nah, you're bugged out, bro. It, it doesn't even make any sense. Like, I don't, I don't know. Ichigo about to violate him right now, though. Yeah, it seems like Ichigo is about to violate him. Um, the training was definitely essential. I, 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 I'm curious to know how exactly it ended too, because we didn't get to see the end. And I didn't expect to see Ichigo come back right away. I thought we was gonna get the backstory on Gin, and then Ichigo was gonna mess him up. Which still want to learn the backstory of Gin and why. What exactly led him to do that? What exactly did Aizen do? What was the significance of the thing that he was taken out of? The lieutenant's People, hands. Yeah. Um, I think that's how he went about creating the Hogeku. Because remember, okay. he said he created his own own Hogeku and then he took Kisuke's and infused it with his. Mm -hmm. I thought he said, I think that was like he was taking people's spiritual energy or whatever. Because mm -hmm. didn't he say something like that? Like, I, I had to take all these people's spiritual energy. I think that's what he was doing to those people. And he probably did that to that whole town. And that's what he that was dropping Rengeku it to the was from and stuff like that. It's possible because he's seen, it's like he's looking at her, like, damaged, all messed up. Then after he went and then seen that Eisen's the person that's responsible for what's going on with them, wherever they're from and stuff. And then it's like, where he's the boss? Bet that's why I got a body and stuff. So it was like a whole big revenge plot and stuff. So, yeah, I, mean, right. I, I think that's the gist of it. That's so savage, though. That's like Mike Tyson. Like, you going up to Mike Tyson and being like, go ahead, bro. Swing at me. <laughs> All right, my turn. But like, yo, I don't, like you're supposed to be that guy, like that guy, and yeah. I'm like, yo, just do your thing, do your thing, go ahead, get, right. get your shit to up. I, I told you, you can't do nothing. Honestly, to me. it's crazy because like just a few episodes ago, like Ichigo didn't stand a chance against 
nothing that Aizen had to offer mm-hmm. before yeah. his transformation, any of them, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And the fact that Ichigo comes, like, he just, in, like, a matter of, like, six episodes goes from, like, losing all faith, being a loser <laughs> to, like, I know it was a three-month period gap, but, like, that that's fire how, like, you know the kind of trouble he went through in his head to finally find that confidence to see the the person that we see now find Aizen, who Aizen does his ultimate attack and just breaks the shit like like yeah. nothing. You know what I'm saying? So, like that, that, he is a good nominee for a first number one pick, Rob. I ain't gonna lie, the you benefits. you better depends hope you got lottery. pick number one or yeah. two. Yeah, As I said, it depends <laughs> on how that lottery go. But yeah. if I if I go first, second, if no one picks him, I mean you could pick anybody. I, Huh? Cause it's like this Goku, this is Vegeta. No, this, I know. Yeah. But I'm saying so, like depending some if nobody picks him, but you mm-hmm. never know. We'll see. Bro, that's the perks of fighting your demons right there. Your boy fought his yeah. demons for three months and then came out <laughs> and was able to beat Aizen after two level ups of Aizen. Mm-hmm. You gotta remember he was struggling before with Aizen. Then Aizen did a, a triple threat f- uh, fight with with uh, Yoruichi, his uh, this dude's dad. And then Kisuke. Then after he, uh, this dude getting kills him, he levels up again, mm-hmm. and then Ichigo is able to defeat him. That's actually kind of crazy when you think about yeah. it, right there. I actually really enjoy Gin Gin's character too, because I feel like um, if we don't get that backstory, then he's probably one of the most one of the characters I want to know way more about in this series. Mm-hmm. Like, you know, what I'm saying I, I want to compare him to like Itachi. That's how much I could like him if he if he had a backstory. Yeah, exactly. Because he's like, it looks like he made his ultimate sacrifice to defeat the the good guy by becoming the bad guy himself. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Um, but I just want to know what about like what about Rangiku's story made you make that decision as a kid, and a little bit more of like what you had to do even as a kid working on the eyes and to really gain his trust. You yeah. know what I'm saying? What I could really Boss. appreciate by about <laughs> Gin is that. The ability to pretty much pump fake everybody for that much for that long period of time to a point where when Aizen faked his death, they thought that Gin was the one who did it. They thought that Gin was the one who was behind all of the corruption having to do with the soul society. Right. And for him to play that role down to the T just for it to come to that moment to where it's like, I'm going to kill Aizen and I'm going to find out how to kill him. I like how the Raiders did that. That that was a good that was a great plot twist because like a lot of people wouldn't. Like, you wouldn't expect it. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you wouldn't expect it. And I need to know more about Gin, though. I need to know more about Gin. Mm-hmm. Bro, I, I watched Brooklyn's Finest and Deep Cover. It's very difficult for cops to... St- like, they say that a lot when in real life, like, it's difficult for a cop to stay undercover for more than three or four years because at that point, you come so submerged within that lifestyle that you end up losing what the hell was I initially exactly. doing this for. You feel mm-hmm. me? So, like, he's been doing this... More than 30, 40 years or something like that. Because he said it took him. Years. Years. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Like 100 years. Like, yeah, you feel me? So the fact that he's able to never lose sight of what the ulterior goal was, that goes to show how level, how strong he is in terms of what he wanted to get done and stuff. Lawrence Fishburne could have do it, bro. That's real love right there. Yeah. He really said, for make it on Giku cry, I do whatever I got to do. I do whatever I got to do for baby. And then it didn't work out for him, but you know, he did, did what he had out. to do. It did work out. Yeah, I mean, he leveled Ichigo up. But yeah. yeah. He said, yo, I can go, I could die now knowing that he got this. Ichigo mm-hmm. ready. Ichigo ready, baby. And it was almost like his sacrifice. Almost it's like Sasuke. I'm, 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 I like to compare him with Itachi because Itachi kind of did the same thing. There was more emphasis on him, but like he, he made Sasuke realize his true potential, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And then even with um, Gini Chimaru, he did the same thing with. Ichigo, even though they didn't, never really had a close relationship at all, but um, it was kind of like, yo, like who is this person I'm fighting? Like I'm done, I'm done, I'm not even gonna be fighting no more. Like mm-hmm. this person that I crossed swords with in the past had this ultimate confidence, and now you don't, which ultimately made Ichigo go into that three month training mm-hmm. and become the Ichigo that we see today. So he he put the battery in his back. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Honestly, now <laughs> thinking about it more retrospectively. It makes sense why Gin actually already nominated Ichigo in his mind as being a person because if if Gin was around all that time, which we've seen, Aizen always plotted on Ichigo as an experiment yeah. of becoming that vessel mm. that could be very strong. So Gin knowing that is like, 
the only person that could possibly be him. It has to be this dude. I shot. We've seen in the flashback. He seen he most he walked into him multiple times while this dude's watching game tape of Ichigo. Mm-hmm. So it makes sense why Gin's like, right, I'm gonna put all my bas- my marbles into my ba- uh, the basket of Ichigo of he's gonna be the one to defeat him. And I feel like when they got to the entrance of the Soul Society that first time. Gin's appearance towards Ichigo was pretty much to be like, "Hey, let me test the waters mm-hmm. to see what to see what what the hype behind this kid is." You know what I'm saying? And for him to come in, and he even brought it up. He's like, "Yo, you had a different type of confidence the first time we fought." I'm not sure if you remember that, and it's essential. It's essential to what they're doing now because he wasn't he wasn't nearly as strong as he is now. So, mm-hmm. shout out to Gin. Gin. Gin is a good is a good scout. Gin is Bill Belichick. <laughs> he the real Bill Belichick. <laughs> he um he also like damn what the fuck oh I feel like uh the the Hogyu coup kind of betrayed Aizen unwilling unwillingly too because I feel like Aizen and wanting Ichigo to become this perfect vessel manifested that with the Hogyu coup and it ended up Ichigo becoming the perfect vessel yeah, or whatever genius, bro. you know what I'm saying I really think that's what happened that actually makes a hundred percent sense mm-hmm. because so, that's. His yeah, his research is all contingent of Ichigo becoming yeah yeah perfection exactly, <laughs> and then it, he became that, and now you're not. You know what I'm saying? Like, uh, I think wow, that's that what makes I mean. complete sense. Mm-hmm. Actually, yeah, yeah, manifestation exactly manifestation. Well, make sure you stay tuned, guys, for this amazing fight between Ichigo and Aizen. And now I'm kind of rooting for Ichigo to defeat Aizen. I didn't think Aizen was gonna <laughs> be defeated to probably the final. Art that's coming out, but I really do think Eisen's about to get defeated. Yeah, now I'm excited. I'm like, who's gonna be the villain that they pop up at the end? Mm-hmm. Yeah, is it you? It's Robbie. It's Rob. Yeah. <laughs> and it's crazy because right after you indict inducted him into the dark willpower, he's about to take it out. So that's that's fire. <laughs> that's fire. <laughs> about them willpower. Man. Yeah. Ah, oh, that's hilarious. But if it's your first time here, it definitely won't be your last. Make sure you kill, murder, and smash that subscribe button. It's your boy Wells, the Anime King. Yo, it's the man, the myth, the maniac, August underscore RT. Shout out to the real Bill Belichick, the whole begin, holding it down. A hundred years undercover, scheming on Eisen? Where they do that? A hundred years, Evan. Yo, what's good, man? It's your boy DC. And one thing you should never listen to is any of Jerry's football takes. He thinks Patrick Mahomes better than Tom Brady. Drop the mic. Come on. You know what's crazy? I didn't say he that. He has the potential, bro. Come on. What you talking about? You see how that, much bro. yards he's throwing? How much? How many yards he's averaging per season? He I thinks don't that, that, that he's not going to go on a revenge money. tour. That's not the argument. He thinks that he's not going to go on a revenge tour. That's that's an argument. Stay tuned for RTTV football takes very dude, soon. Dude, we making shit up. Black man. Oh, I thought my fault. They should wear up to the RT. And that settles it at the, the round, round table. table. Drop that heat.